Hey, this is Chad with Monday Scientific. Today, we're gonna take this Leica S6D on a boom stand and we're gonna disassemble and reassemble it to help you whenever you buy one. Okay, the first and most important thing is to remove the pod. There's gonna be a thumb screw right here. And we're gonna take that out and set it to the side somewhere nice and safe um, so it doesn't tilt over. And then uh, we have to take this arbor out. So this part that goes down it's the arbor or the bonder arm. Um, first, we're gonna take the locking screw out. Whenever you receive this, this will be disassembled so it doesn't get uh, bent and chipping. So whenever you move that, it'll swivel really freely. And then for this particular scope, the bonder arm takes a four millimeter Allen wrench. It's gonna have a locking washer that holds it on. So it'll be the screw and the washer and then that Bonder arm will pull right out with the, the focus uh, assembly. All right, from there, you're gonna remove this runaway collar. And once you remove that, you're gonna take this knob right here, loosen it, and the whole assembly um, will come off. We'll set that to the side and then you have another runaway collar here. These are really nice if, the, um, if that, that knob that I was just turning gets loosened the scope cannot fall and crash into the table or the specimen because of this. It'll catch it so you want to set that right underneath where this is set. All right we'll slide that off and then the last part this screw right here is a 10. Um, I've got an eight right here, but it's actually a 10 millimeter and we send that in the boxes with them when we ship it. So you would just loosen this and take that bolt out and this post would come right off. All right, we're gonna put the whole thing back together. So first, whenever you receive your box, this, this post right here will not be on this stand. You'll need a 10 millimeter wrench that will be included in the box. You want to put this post, there's only one hole that'll fit in, kind of align them, screw this bolt into the post, make sure it's really tight and set it up. All right, the next thing, you wanna put your runaway collar on. All right, when the runaway collar goes on, you're nice and set, and then you will put the adjustable swivel on so you can move the microscope back and forth. Um, we ship these cleaned and dry right here, but you might want to put a little bit of lubricant like a three in one oil or some kind of fine oil uh, right here in this track and that'll help uh, adjust the stand. Okay, once that goes on, you got to put your focus assembly in or your pod carrier. So you will grab your washer and your screw. And then your four millimeter Allen wrench to tighten it down. When you tighten this down, it's still gonna be a little loose. It's gonna be free swinging. I'm gonna adjust this. You just saw how the runaway collar worked. Whenever I loosened it, it was a little heavy, it fell down. Um, that's what's great about these. It'll hold it in place while everything's loose. Then you wanna put this adjustment screw that we take out so it doesn't get bent for shipping and lock that in. And you'll notice that pod carrier is really good and stiff now. It, um, it's really secure. So you want that. Um, if you need to adjust your pod, you can loosen it and swivel it depending on your application. Some folks look at it like this, some use this, some people want to turn it around, some people want the pod to be away from the stand. These stands are really durable and heavy, so it makes it really nice um, whenever you're looking at your specimen. Then you take your runaway collar, that keeps everything nice and in place in case anyone's messing with the microscope that's unsure of how to use it. 
that screws in. It's a long thread. It takes you know, several turns to get it in. And then you will put your pot in. The microscope's ready to use. Um, we'll go over the microscope really quick so you can see it. This Leica S6D has a couple, uh, two eyepieces. They're 10X by 23 focusable eyepieces. This particular model has a Leica 0.5 camera adapter. There will be a camera in, uh, included in the shipment. And then it also has a 0.5X front lens to give extra working distance. You can use the scope with or without this. It will decrease your working distance if you have if you don't have it on there'll be an led ring light in the box uh, it just fits over and the screws tighten on around this front lens um, this is a great inspection of stereoscope the camera that comes with is really uh, easy to use and user friendly and inexpensive so if you have any questions uh, give us a call about the scope